Hi, I'm Clifford Andrews and I'm at the Berlin Energy Medicine Symposium. I just want to say how happy I am to finally be here. It's just so great to actually be here because this has taken so much preparation over the last year and certainly the last week. Um, Jim and I have been like, emailing backwards and forwards um, trying to find something we hope will be very interesting and exciting for today. Part of this has to do with the language that we use to communicate with others who would like to understand your work. About a year and a half ago, a very good friend of mine, Carol Beresford Cook, bought me a book for my birthday, <laughs> and it was called Energy Medicine, A Scientific Basis. When I finished reading it, I thought, this changes everything. Um, and so now it's like, well, how can it be that if you do this, or you align, or you breathe, or you press, or what, how, or you scan, how can that, how can that actually, you know, how can it actually, you know, work? <laughs> <laughs> so these two laws of physics show that we can go from the physics laboratory to the human body and understand a lot of the things that are going on. The, even I. A scientist could sense something. There's hope for everyone then. <laughs> I can do it, anybody can. Here is some evidence about entrainment, about the connecting of your biological rhythms, your energy rhythms, with the person that you're working on. And what they discovered is one person's electrocardiogram, their electrical heart rhythm entrains or synchronizes with the other person's brain rhythm. It's called the electroencephalogram. Most of the tissues in the body are piezoelectric flow and applying pressure. The piezoelectric effect. It's created by compression within the liquid crystal structure of the body. People looking for the laser beam didn't know about the work of Herbert Froelich. Herbert Froelich discovered that these crystalline materials in the body, when they have an electrical field across them, will vibrate intensely and produce coherent laser-like light. All those people that thought we were crazy and thought it was impossible, now, I'm afraid, the only thing we can say is they're out of date. <laughs>